Each one's where one of them pricked me, and each thing is attached to a venom gland. 15-year-old so. Logan Pergola still has the marks left over from a painful run-in with one of these. This is known as a pus caterpillar. The University of Florida says it's the most venomous caterpillar in the U.S. Never expected like a caterpillar to have so much of an effect. He was clearing brush over the weekend when his arm just barely grazed over the little bug. The rash went. At first, he thought it was a simple scratch, but. The entire arm and even to my chest at that point. Less than an hour later, he'd wind up in the ER. Pretty much like the whole arm was numb, but it felt like it was on fire almost, and it like radiated from where they pricked me. It was really scary once we got to the hospital and they started moving so quickly because I kind of had expected them to sit us in the emergency room and wait, and they're like, oh no, he's going straight back. This is his actual body. Logan's mom would post about the ordeal on Facebook. It's been shared oh, look, foreign language. more than 400,000 times. I wanted to let them know, like, hey, beware. I kept thinking about small kids, and I'm like, if like my four-year-old niece were to pick this up, I can't imagine what it would do to a tiny child. It was sort of like a drill almost into the bone. Logan is yeah. better now, and when he says he's out. keeping an eye out for these guys. They're the opposite of furry and cute. Definitely trying to be more careful than before and just trying to be more aware. All right, if you are stung by one of those, put tape over the sting to remove any spines. Use ice packs to reduce swelling. And of course, if it's bad enough, seek medical attention right away. Cynthia, back to you. This has been a really good warning. I put it on Facebook, Josh, yeah. and already I've had like three people say, oh yeah, I removed a couple of those from a wall or yeah, from a, yeah. a tree. So they're out there. Absolutely. All right, thank you, Josh. Mm -hmm.